Here we go. Beautiful. Goodness. This is a change of pace from our last outing. Don't remind me. The thought of that tent still makes my blood boil. I've been thinking about those poor dragons in the fighting ring. The collars they were wearing, they appeared to be goblin silver. I think a collar is precisely what we found at that poacher camp. I've never known poachers to use anything like that before. The dragon that attacked my carriage was wearing a collar, and Professor Fig was genuinely baffled by its behavior. That attack always did strike me as a little strange, seemingly coming out of nowhere. Surely you aren't suggesting that the collars somehow control the poor creatures? Exactly. Merlin, I don't think the dragon we set free was wearing a collar, but we should check. And if we can find her, we can return her egg. That's a good idea. We need to see this through. I'll start looking into it right away. There was something else that I wanted to discuss with you. What, Poppy? I didn't want to press it before. It seems I may have caused you more trouble with Victor Rookwood. Bro, ain't nobody worried about him. after you? Bro, cuz that little midget gonna fuck him up <laughs> if you don't if you don't try to capture me, bro. He weak as hell, bro. I rather not say that at present. Uh, shot to last. Uh, that's saying too much. You might be like, man, fuck it. I ain't scared Rookwood of nothing. is working with Ranrock, and Ranrock is after something I found at Gringotts. Fig had a port key that led us there after the dragon attack. It's a bit of a long story, and Fig had asked that I not speak of it yet. Goodness. That's good juice. That's good juice, y'all. Well, that certainly helps to shed light on what we saw at the tent. Don't worry. I'll guard your secret as if it were my own. I shan't press for more details. In fact, I should probably be going. I'd like to track that dragon down as soon as I can. I realize I told her that she's not even slithering. I have news of her location. I think Natty knows too, though. Yeah, I think Natty know. Natty not slithering either, I told her. <laughs> oh my god. Ah. Oh, it's in my heart. In my chest. Pause. Ah. I'm talking about the pen. The blink. Oh, so I got a tear. All right. I can get. Ah, I know it's still burnt. This shit burnt. Okay. Oh, let's go to the undercraft. Get me in there. <coughs> ah. Ooh. I feel it coming out my ears, bro. And hey, what's up with it? You'll never believe what I. What did you discover in the spellbook we found in the scriptorium? Salazar Slytherin's spellbook was a little difficult to interpret, but fascinating. Evidently, he encouraged teaching dark magic at Hogwarts. Neither the Imperious Curse nor the Killing Curse was unforgivable during his time. He believed students should be prepared to use dark magic when necessary, not to fear it. That's why we had to use Crucio to gain access to the Scriptorium. He didn't want his knowledge shared with anyone who was afraid of the power of dark magic. Oh, bro. It was hard to do, but casting Crucio was our only option. And I'm glad we did it. Because in the spell book, I bet I you are, nigga. Else. You ain't get Crucio. to a lost relic, which, from what I can tell, grants the holder the power to reverse dark magic curses. And you think this relic might be able to save Anne? Precisely. I plan to search for this relic, but I don't think we should tell anyone. Especially Ominous. He wouldn't understand. Man. I see no reason to involve Ominous. I'm glad you agree. That boy when not I knock. More, I shall send him out. Send it out in, my boy. For ominous. Keeping this to ourselves for now is for his own good. We oh, already know I like that nigga. Good. I was in there. <laughs> we were just about to get some air. Care to join? You're bro, he always got his. Oh I shit! Everything. You swore you'd never engage in anything to do with dark magic again. <laughs> no, I didn't. I said I understood you wanting that. I'd never swear to give up on finding a cure for Anne. You don't know when to stop, do you? I know when to Oops. Leave this alone, Ominous. I'll be on my way. Lumos. I need to remember I to do this. I am not letting this go. 
Ominous. Sebastian Manuel. I know what I heard. You knew I wouldn't agree with this. Going after that relic is not a good idea. Sebastian doesn't even realize it, but he's as irresponsible and reckless now as his parents were years ago. It's why they died. Damn, folk. Hey, let me know something. I knew his parents died, but I never heard what happened. Mr. and Mrs. Sallow were professors, spent nearly every waking moment in the cellar library, nose is buried in books. Anne and Sebastian were upstairs when it happened. They heard a sudden crash and ran downstairs, but it was too late. Their parents had crumpled to the floor. A defect with the lamp in the cellar caused the room to fill with an undetectable toxin. Sebastian and Anne were helpless. They had no magic yet. What a horrible story. It is. That's why I can't understand Sebastian's recklessness. I've practically lost Anne. I cannot lose Sebastian too. Please avoid anything to do with that spell book. Hey, Ominous. I'm gonna do what the fuck I want, nigga. Those references in the book seem promising. Everything to do with Salazar Slytherin seems promising until it's too late. I hope Sebastian pursues this no further. But if you think he might, please let me know. Nigga, fuck you, nigga. It would mean a lot. I don't care about what mean a lot. Well, when you think I was on your team, bro, I'm never on your... Bro, nigga, I will fight you right now. I don't like your ass, boy. Fuck out of here. Fuck wrong with buddy ass. Go fast, nigga. Simple enough. Easy. Easy, baby. Easy, baby. Easy, baby. Easy, baby. Now I'm a Thanos snap this bitch. Huh. That book Professor Weasley asked me to find should be around here somewhere. Looking for Rebellion. Immediate transfiguration. Bro, why do I have to talk to her? I do not have to talk to her, bro. Just from my family the book. Bro, they gonna make me talk to this book. Ah, what you, what? Why? Professor Weasley asked me to, uh, uh, get something from that book. Oh, they she got it. it. That's why. Did she now? Oh my god, this bitch gonna have me going to quiz? If you humor me by answering a few questions from my quiz. Quiz? Some oh my people god, call knowledge bro. trivia. I would argue that no knowledge is trivial. Hence, I have created a small quiz, just for fun, focusing mainly on the lore of the wizarding world. None of the other students will try it, no matter how many times I ask. Yeah, they I wonder why. have enough with schoolwork. Oh, they don't value knowledge the way I do. Surely you're interested. I'll even start you off with a few of my easiest questions. Man, you lucky I need it, bro. If that's the only way I can convince you to give me that book, then let's get it over with. Splendid. Just a few questions, and then I'll hand over this book. Why would you even want to Let play with somebody that's acting Before like that, bro? the invention of the golden snitch, which magical creature was used in a game of Quidditch? Bitch, what? I don't know. Wait. I'm going to search it up. Fuck wrong. <coughs> hey, Siri. Before the invent invention of the golden snitch, what magical creature was used in the game of Quidditch? Here's what I found. The Golden Snidget. The Golden Snidget. Correct! The Snidget was first introduced to Quidditch in 1269 by a wizard named Barbarous Bragg. Sadly, they're thought to be extinct. Next question. Which potion is commonly referred to as Liquid Luck? I probably could guess this one, oh, folks. Liquid Luck. Wait, nah, because how the fuck would you get your... The pupper up? I don't even know... Uh, Felix Flake. What the fuck? I don't know. What what sounds like the what sounds like liquid luck? Okay, let's just we're gonna just educate the guests in school. A B C no D. So it's a uh, thirty three percent chance. You know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna go. It's really, really not. It's like a sixty six. Cause, huh? Felix Felicis. Well done. What? Since it makes the drinker temporarily lucky, Felix Felicis is a banned substance in all organized competitions. Well, I just guess the fuck out the there. <laughs> involves which magical artifacts? Oh, shit. Wait. The tale of the three brothers involves which magical artifacts? Uh, the Deathly Hallows. I feel like that would be some shit they'd do. Because... 
ain't that like Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows? Was that? I don't know. That sound like some shit they do. I want the three brothers. Why would we? Why, who would even know this? Um, is this like supposed to be? Like, how would you even know this? Like, how is this a mission? The Deathly Hallows. Correct. According to Beedle the Bard, the Deathly Hallows consists Bro, of the no Elder Wand, the Resurrection Stone, and the Cloak of Invisibility. Which ball in Quidditch is the largest? It's, it, I thought it was just three questions. Why well, I just think it was three? Why did I assume it was three? Did she say three? True or false? Oh my Quidditch's god. Quidditch's potion big. allows the drinker to change species. That's false as hell. False. Correct. While Polyjuice Potion uh, can be used to change too. things such as age or race, it cannot be used to change species. Well, I suppose this has gone on long enough. I'll put the book back on the pedestal now. If you're inclined to test your knowledge again, I have plenty more questions I could ask you. And I won't be giving you any more easy questions either. The next ones will be more difficult. I I'm sorry. I don't have time for a quiz at the moment. Let me know if you change your mind. Even though I just did one. Got a I 90 on the auto. The pedestal for you. Yeah, whatever. Sure. To make quick work of this. Professor Weasley's tasks are complete. I can attend Transfiguration. Yes, sir. Let's do it. A little bit. I heard you a little bit. Oh, no, no. Class started. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Oh, I know they're going to love. Big L. Settle down, settle down. We settling, we settling. Transfiguration, as you may be weary of hearing me say, Transfiguration. is a that can take a lifetime to master. But it's been a while since I've been in this class. I forgot that he was my partner. Almost anything can be transformed if you can just perceive the potential within it. As I see in all of you, tremendous witches and wizards, every one of you, or it could just be my eyesight. Now, you all know what to do. Yeah, there go a butterfly. I ain't doing what she did. Watch these. Ugh. 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 In me in there. In there. But it's too easy for me, boy. I ain't gonna lie. I should be done with this game. <laughs> oh, this game been on like five months or some shit, boy. My ass keep not playing and not recording. Like, bro, what the fuck wrong with me? I'll be tripping. I'll be tripping. More inconsistent ass. Class is dismissed. And remember, now is not the time to ease off your studying. OWLs will be here before you know it. Uh, okay. OWLs. Oh, that's some type of test. More often ace that bitch. This is going to be the first time in life I'm going to be good at school. Oh, shit. I was supposed to be. I didn't mean to say that. Y'all, that slipped out. I mean, let's just talk to Professor, okay. You wanted to discuss my progress so far this term, Professor. I did. You seem to have had no trouble in getting up to speed. And frankly, excelling in your schoolwork this year. Man, it's just like, it's like I'm living, it's like I'm playing alternate reality of myself, man. It makes me feel good, bro. I never heard that. You know what I'm saying? Ever. Maybe like once. When I was younger. As soon as they added some other shit in that bitch, I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> uh, Thank you, Professor. The extra assignments have been helpful. As I suspected they would be. Now, it seems you've been making good use of the opportunities presented by your field guide. Yeah. Of course, the guide isn't the only measure of success. I've heard that you can brew an impressive Edurus potion. What a default ass potion. Anytime soon, but it is a valuable potion to have when I barely do. But you, you also professor. absolutely I right. I say I'm especially impressed with all you've Bro, her shoulder pads are crazy. Bitch go up at an angle. Were your meetings with Professor Black's house I think, an you know, exploration of various Probably. caves down by the lake connected in any way to Professor Fig? Professor Fig, bro, I want some Fig Newtons, no cap. What you mean for Professor Black's house, elf, and exploration, curious, bro? Uh, 
No. Not at all. I was uh, intrigued by stories of a giant squid and wanted to learn more. I encountered Scrope, who seemed delighted to share what he knew. I see. I admire your penchant for learning, but do remember that your classwork and field guide are designed to educate you thoroughly. It'll be the end of the year in no time, and you'll want to be well prepared for your OWLs. One more I'll beef. provide a final assessment at that time to ensure that you're ready for your exams. Until then, well done. You are dismissed. Well, I got three classes of a whole year. Crazy bitch. If you wish bitch. to practice the spell you just learned, the training dummy is available. So what, am I going to turn this thing into a butterfly? Like, what's going on? Hold up. I got to see what the fuck... What the fuck that even do, bitch. Glad to see you were paying close attention to my demonstration of the transformation spell. Oh, uh, all they did just say, so you just changed like. To Feldcroft. Something dawned on me about the triptych. Yeah, let me know some Sebastian. Just okay. The forbidden forest, and I'll explain. My plan with the helmet failed, but I have another idea. I think we may be able to find what we need at a goblin mine south of Hogwarts. Incendio. I remember our meat mentioning something about gobbledygook. Ooh, level one unlocked, baby. I'm gonna get in her shit. Whoa. I don't know about her, bro. I wanna do it to her, bro. Can't do it to Miss Wheelie, bro. Can't do it, won't do it. You wanted to speak with me, mother? Oh, that's your mama. I had hoped to speak with you alone, Natsai. Your message mentioned your concern about an unusual creature that was spotted in the woods near Hogsmeade. That could have been anything. You know what it was, Natsai. I am allowed to leave the castle. I am always careful, mother. Careful? Officer Singer disagrees. She sent me an owl telling me that you have been trying to collect evidence of some kind against dark wizards. She berated me for not keeping a closer eye on you, and she is right. I do not want you visiting Hogsmeade for the near future. But mother! We've been a back talk. My little gazelle, you are well intentioned, but you must not meddle in the affairs of dangerous what? people. What? I thought she was gonna back in the shit out here. Father would still be with us. Oh no. She she got to gotta, nah. Perhaps your friend what? can get you to listen to What? Me. You're not black. You can't be. So frustrating. What? <laughs> oh my she god. She never listens to me. She called you her little gazelle. Is that a term of endearment where you're from? It is specific to me. <sighs> I am the unusual creature in Hogsmeade she mentioned. Self-transfiguration is not taught at Hogwarts, so I am gently discouraged from practicing it. However, I am an animagus. And it is in my gazelle form that I have been able to wander the highlands rather freely until now. Much to my mother's chagrin. Oh, that she is could shape shit? to spy on Rookwood and Harlow. Oh, that, yeah, that is incredible. I ain't gonna lie. Hold on. I, don't, I wanna ask her some questions. How does it feel to transform into an animal? Well, the first time, it can be a bit unnerving. I felt a kind of searing pain and a strong double heartbeat. But it gets easier the more you do it. I no longer feel any pain, and I must say, I find a sense of comfort in the double heartbeat. And I love what being able like to safe. view the world from a different perspective. Can you choose what form your animagus will be? I swear I better be able oh, to do no. this shit. A person's animagus form is determined by their personality. Oh yeah, I'm my a wolf. Mother is I already know it. that my form is a gazelle because I adapt well to any situation. I believe it is because I can sense danger and keep my wits about me. And you be getting your little ass hunted, oh, bro. Uh, no I should say how she should became one. Damn it! Extraordinary ability to have. It is. I love transforming. Fuck. My mother is less enthusiastic about it. She says that no creature, especially one as rare as a gazelle, should be bounding about where poaching has become so prevalent. <sighs> She claims that she has foreseen tragedy befall me in my gazelle form. But she has used her sight to control me too many times. I no longer believe it. What? You sound dumb. We were just talking about poachers. 
Why would you transform into a gazelle, something that cannot defend against anything that's going to be just running, running? And if they be hunting fucking mythical creatures, boy, they definitely going to capture your little ass gazelle ass. Boy, they ass got more fucking, what, Nightwing and shit? Whatever the fuck his name was, Night Howl. I don't know what his name was. Big ass owl birds. They got them centaurs and shit. You think they ain't capture no gazelle? You crazy as hell. <laughs> we can't allow your mother to stop us. Angle low, fuck that. We're making good progress. We can't quit now. I agree. I have never considered quitting, <laughs> even for a moment. You could have fled the moment you discovered that Rookwood, Harlow, and Rand Rock. Yeah, I'm trying to shut this shit down, boy. But you did not. I choose to act as you have. I must deal with Rookwood and Harlow, not hide from them. My mother cannot know where I am all the time. And this walk ain't had no daughter, yo. During that rather awkward conversation. Yeah, it was awkward. The way you was talking about to your mama like that. Like she ain't just can't just beat the shit out your ass. I'm crazy as hell.